Today's canning chat question has to do with canning Roma tomatoes. My name is Sharon Peterson and I am with simplycanning.com where you can find home canning, tips, tutorials, and online canning classes. Come join me there and I will help you get your pantry filled. So today's canning chat question is from Kay, who is actually in Manitoba, Canada. So her question is, I'm going to attempt canning my Romas today. Romas meaning aroma tomato. This looks like an easy recipe that even I could do. Is it really 85 minutes to process in a water bath? Why so long? I was sure it was only 20 minutes when I did salsa. So that is a really good question. Um, so yes, it is the correct time for canning in a water bath. And it does seem long, but those directions come from the National Center for Home Food Preservation. Um, that's the tested method. This is canning tomatoes with no added liquid. You just put the tomato in the jar, you push it down so the juice comes out and it just fills up with its own juice. So I'm not adding anything to it. Keep in mind that there is a difference in processing time. If you just put your tomatoes lightly in the jar and add water, it's gonna be a different time. So this is canning tomatoes in its own juice. So I will put a link to the recipe down below. Um, the reason the time seems long compared to canning a salsa, for example, is because a salsa has added acid. It's got, um, you know, of course it's the tomatoes, usually onions and peppers, and it has the added acid usually in the form of vinegar. Um, and that is what it makes, what makes it safe for processing for a shorter time in a water bath. Um, a water bath, all the safety issues, or I shouldn't say all, most of the safety is based on the acidity level of the food. It also has to do with the density of the food and some things like that. But the, the acidity level is why salsa can be a shorter time and a tomato, a plain tomato, would be the longer time. So um, one thing I wanna mention here is I cannot comment on the safety of your particular salsa recipe because I don't know what it is, but I'm assuming that you're using a tested recipe, you've got those ratios correct, you've got the correct acidity levels, and so then yes, salsa is gonna be shorter than just canning a plain aroma tomato. So I hope that was helpful. Um, you guys have a wonderful afternoon and I will see you in the next canning chat video. We'll talk to you later. Bye.